An international group of astronomers, led by a physicist at the University of St. Andrews, has revived an alternative gravity theory. A previous examination of the rotation speed of gas in the dwarf galaxy AGC 114905 discovered that the gas rotated very slowly, thereby claiming that the Mond theory was dead. Such ideas are critical to understanding our universe, because galaxies revolve so swiftly that they should fly apart, according to known physics, Mond, a contentious alternative to general relativity. The dominant Einstein-inspired concept of gravity that requires dark matter to hold galaxies together does not require dark matter, because dark matter has never been identified after decades of extremely sensitive searches. Several hypotheses have been proposed to explain what keeps galaxies together, and disagreement continues over which is correct. The extremely slow rotation speed revealed in this study contradicts predictions in a world ruled by general relativity and containing a lot of dark matter. Dr. Banach's group contends that if the galaxy's inclination is overstated, the high anticipated rotation speed in the Mond gravity theory is compatible with the data. The spin of the stars and gas in faraway galaxies cannot be directly measured. Exact spectroscopic measurements reveal just a component, along with the line of sight. When seen approximately face-on, the galaxy will primarily revolve within the plane of sky. This might include viewers to believe that the galaxy is rotating very slowly, causing them to overestimate the inclination between the disk and sky planes. The inclination was calculated based on how elliptical the galaxy appears. This critical problem was investigated in the latest work using sophisticated MON simulations of a disk galaxy comparable to AGC 114905. The simulations indicate that it can seem elliptical even when seen from the side. This is due to the fact that stars and gas in the galaxy have gravity and may drag themselves into a non-circular form. A similar process produces spiral forms in disk galaxies, which are so common that they're often referred to as spiral galaxies. According to the current analysis, a similar, false inclination effect is unlikely to occur in the classic dark matter method, since the galaxy is dominated by the smooth dark matter halo. Because the stars and gas contribute very little to gravity, the disk is not self-gravitating. For more information about this study, check the video description. Thanks for watching.